Hey, hey, welcome again to another OK, OK Daily Doodle. Um, I apologize. My program for recording crashed. Um, seems like I got towards the end and it got tired of recording, so it just cut out. But um, here is the finished product from yesterday's Daily Doodle. Uh, it turned out good. Um, I wanted to explain that I went back with a big cloud brush uh, I used a color that was a dark red. Um, I'll show you right down here. Uh, this color right here is not black. It is like a dark red right there. And I chose that dark red because it's going to make the blue and the blue green really pop. And the blue green makes that dark red feel really dark, even darker than black. And it feels more alive and just um, like there's lots of, lots of, uh, uh, feeling in the atmosphere and that's what we're going for can you feel it can you feel it in the air okay so now I'm gonna be working on this shirt of this blonde girl uh, she's been zombified and impregnated so we're going to uh, choose a darker red um, I'm gonna go down to the pinker uh, version just a little bit and the light's going to be coming from over here, so we'll shade um, all of this and kind of give it this uh, feeling like the light is coming directly, like there's a spotlight on her belly. I think that'll help make the belly feel large and important. And that's what we're going for today. Um, for the shirt, I'm using just the basic brush with a softer edge. Um, for the boobs, we'll do a really soft edge to get some really nice uh, graduation, gradual gradation, <laughs> graduation. Um, uh, we'll come back with this brush, uh, which is pressure based, and create some. Uh, stretch stretchy lines like the stretch shirt is being stretched oh my gosh I am saying so many tongue twisters today gradual gradi gradual gradations and stretchy shirt sh shirt stretches yeah okay so um, I feel like anchorman <laughs> Will Ferrell's anchorman when he's New York knows nobody I don't know what is what does he say? Ooh, who cares? All right. Um, so I'm doing a little bit of stretches here. I'm going to come back and um, kind of make all these stretches seem not so abrupt and um, not so much like stripes, but like the shirt is stretching with uh, these stretch marks all right so we got that going give a little bit of a roundness over here we might come back with a, a secondary light source make this a little cool over here um, we get the airbrush tool pressure based again All right, I'm enjoying this cover because it feels like a dream or something. It feels like I'm uh, in a dream while I'm drawing this. Okay, so this is where I'm coming back and I'm kind of uh, trying to make these stretch marks not so much like stripes, but kind of like the whole shirt is stretching. Okay, that's nice. Now I'm going to add a little bit of a highlight. With red, highlights are kind of tough. Um, they're very apparent, so you have to be very uh, subtle with your... Okay, subtle with your highlights. 
I am going to come back over here and do some uh, like lactation, but I'm not going to do that in a YouTube video because uh, if you have, if you saw my summer's boob expansion video, uh, that got flagged because um, there was lactation in it, and eventually I peeled it and it eventually came back online. But I just want to avoid any um, flaggers and not give them any uh, not give them anything to stand on. So I'll do that off screen, and you'll see it in the finished product, but you just won't see it in the daily do. Okay, so I'm going to kind of pull these lines together again. All right. It's looking good. Good. Okay. That's what I'm going for is just a very gradual. I don't want it to stand out too much. Um We've got the shirt going really well. I'll put a little bit more dark back here. We'll make this a little more dramatic. A little darker back here. And when I'm doing the stretch shirt, I do a little kind of like, um, if you're watching the screen, I do like waves almost, uh, like W's for the stretches. That way it feels like it's realistic and not um, uh, not so bland. <laughs> I don't know what the word is for that. <coughs> <coughs> oh, I think I need some water. Okay, so that's her shirt. Let's move on real quickly to her face. Again, with the flush tones, we go darker, we go a little more red. So I'm going to pull this down slightly to more red. That looks good to me. Oh gosh, I am feeling dizzy. Uh, that cough made me dizzy. All right, so. Oh. Gosh, I forgot, it's out of habit, but um, we're going to be doing underlighting, so I'll change that. Did the opposite of what I needed to do. Give her eye, eye sockets, kind of light. All right. Um, okay, so this is a problem. Uh, it's kind of hard to know what to do here. Usually I don't do the eyes half closed, but that's the case right here. We'll come back later and give her a little uh, lipstick or lip, give her lips some color. This is just a um, placeholder kind of thing. Put a pin in it. Okay, I'm going to blot out her eyes so I don't affect those. I'll blot out your eyes. <laughs> Okay, so we've got a nice gradual thing on her face here. Um, I'm going to gradually bring up a shadow from the base because her shirt is kind of blocking that light. Now we're coming over here. Oh gosh, kids are awful today. Okay, we've got light going down over here. Do a little bit of a. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> Gosh, kids are nuts. I'm feeling so bad right now for my wife. Um, all right, so we've got a belly to do. I'm going to do the belly on a different 
daily doodle we'll get this uh, we'll get this everything else covered before then sounds like somebody got hurt upstairs Okay, the hand. Hands can be hard to um, shade because you want to do just a little bit of shading on them sometimes, but because too much shading makes it look strange. <laughs> All right, got the arm here. Again, this is the Goddesses of Fertility cover. Um, I'm finished. I finished up every page, and I'm posting the comic today. Uh, if you'd like to uh, read the comic, uh, you can go over to my Deviant Art page and uh, download the comic. It's nine dollars. Okay. Now I'm going to get the airbrush tool to help this kind of gradiate or to kind of go back into the background. I'm going to give it some color, some darkness, make that highlight a little more subtle, subtle. Okay. Uh, she doesn't have fingernails. Um, I'm just going to leave that, leave that be giving our little airbrush tools around the knuckles. Uh, the other thing is this would be bright. Okay. Okay, next we'll do the belly. So tune in tomorrow for a giant pregnant belly to be shaded and some zombie eyes, I guess. Glowing zombie eyes. Thanks for stopping by and watching this daily doodle. Uh, stop by tomorrow, and I'll see you then. Later.